Hey guys, Drew from GeoArm here again, and I am going to quickly show you how to put in your Z-Wave uh, communication device into your L7000 panel. Um, basically what you're going to do here is you're going to open the screen. As you can see, I've already pretty much opened it up and it's ready to go here. So what you're going to do is you're going to find the little tab that's right underneath the speaker. It's right about here. Basically, you're going to take the Wi-Fi module, which is right here. You're going to get that MAC and MAC CRC off of there. If you can read that, uh, the MAC starts off 00D as in Delta, 02D. We need the last six off of that, and we also need the CRC number, which is four digits and located, looks like, just to the right of it, right there. Um, all right, and basically what you're going to do to put this in, you're going to find the tab underneath the speaker, which is located right here. You're going to slide it on like so. Bam. All right, now what's in there, you're going to go ahead and close it up. going to plug it in. It takes just a second to power up here. When you're powering it up, you will see that it's going through its data progressions here. Just going through everything, making sure it's okay. Just takes a couple seconds here for it to come up. Still going through its progression here. Then it'll pop up, and when it pops up, you're going to see that it says standby across the top of the screen. There it is. Now you'll see on this on this screen, it's not very much clutter at all. I mean, it has your video, which is one of the new features uh, where you can view your video cameras. Um, it also has your looks like home automation here, and uh, of course your security tab, which enables you to arm, disarm, uh, you know those kinds of things. It also only has two buttons now. Obviously, you can tell that there is a panic switch here. You're going to press and hold that down, and it'll bring up a menu of panics. You're going to press that panic down for police, fire, or medical, and uh, the appropriate authorities will be dispatched. Uh, the home screen will take you to the home screen uh, if you're at any other point on this, uh, on this little map here on the screen. But uh, we should be coming up here in a second. You see it gathered a time now, even though it's incorrect, but that's okay. <laughs> All right, now we're ready to go. So what you're gonna do when you're ready to program your Wi-Fi up, you're going to go into security. You're going to press the more tab. You're going to go into tools. You're going to press 4112. All right. You're going to go into program. Then you are going to go into com diagnostics. You're going to see a little tab that says configure Wi Fi. What's going to happen here? You're going to press the top, which is scan access points. You'll find your wireless access point, and then you are going to highlight it. Um, in this case, it looks like it'll be this one here. And then you're going to click edit. Once you click edit, you're going to click the key tab, which is located here. You'll put in your Wi-Fi password. Then you'll click done. Once you click done, you will see a join tab in the bottom left. You're going to press that join tab. It'll go through the joining process until it says device has been successfully added to the network. At that point, you are ready to communicate. And uh, then you can call up your GeoArm representative, and we can go ahead and get your account put online with us here so you are central station monitored. Thanks a lot, guys. My name is Drew Davis. I work with GeoArm Security. If you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call, one 877 4 Thanks a lot.